Hi guys! Well, I know I haven't been posting videos lately. I'm going to start posting a video at least once a week for sure. And well, today's video I was just going to do a video on how I do my regular makeup to go to school or to go out because a lot of people have been asking me on how I usually do it. So today, let's I'm just going to show you how I... First off, I'm going to use Dream Fresh BB 8-in-1 Beauty Balm. It's a light medium tint. Usually I just use this all around my face. Once you put this cream on, it you feel like your face is breathing and you feel more fresh. It also helps with acne. Sorry guys if I look up, it's because it's hard to do your makeup on the camera. So I'm just going to use the mirror in front of me. Okay, once you're done with that, I use a Magic Nude Liquid Powder. And it has SPF 18. It's from L'Oreal. And it's 312 Classic Ivory. This really doesn't help you to like hide any of like acne or anything. It's just kind of a base for me, I guess, before I put my foundation on. And you're just going to do the same thing and just rub it all over your face. Okay, once you're done with that. You're just going to put your foundation on. I use Maybelline New York. It's called Fit Me. And I use the little stick ones. And I use the number 10. It's Light Leaker. You can use a 15. 15 works also because it's a lighter color. But I like using one tone up because my skin, I'm usually outside working out or whatever. And my usually my face color is different from my skin color. So put it under your eye. And anywhere where you have any kind of blemish or acne. I look like I'm an Indian about to go fight. <laughs> okay. Usually I have a little sponge to blend it out with. But I did not bring it today. So, using your fingers works too, plus it helps. I think it's better than a sponge, in my opinion. So, I just kind of blend it out everywhere. Okay. Once you're done with that, I use a Bare Minerals powder. It's been really helping me. Mostly because I've gone to Sephora and I've gone to MAC. And I will get cosmetics or powders that really clog up my pores and this one seems to be more of a lighter tone especially if you work out so I have volleyball and I will come to the gym and work out afterwards it helps for your pores not to get clogged and I and I have felt it and I have seen a difference with this one and it's just kind of like my color skin and they have really good deals on these because it came with a little pack with other stuff I'm just gonna use a little brush to just tap it in and this one came with this also, so. And you're not going to rub it. You're going to tap it in your skin. After that, I use L'Oreal Paris True Match Powder. It's the True Match Powder. It's classic ivory. And this is a little sponge that comes with it. I actually do like this sponge, too. I will use this one to blend in my foundation if I don't have my other brush, but... Today I just decided not to use it because I just, I like the way your fingers look better. And then next, I'm using a Neutrogena Skin Clearing Mineral Powder. This is a very good powder. If you don't like using like a lot of powders, I recommend this one as your main one because it has salicylic in it. And salicylic is a oil that you put on your skin that will help clear acne. I have salicylic in a little face mask and I like this since it's in here I can wear it every day and it won't clog up my pores as badly. So just use the sponge from the other one. I mean this one comes with its own sponge also but I just like using the other one. So just put that in there. This one you can rub in. Okay, once you're done with that last powder, you're just going to get, this is a MAC 133 brush. It's kind of angled, and I use it to put my blush and my bronzer on. Today's bronzer is just a MAC bronzer that I got. It does 
help me like bring out a glow. So you're just gonna tap it. Kind of make like a duck face and just put it in on the edges of your cheekbones. on the tip of my nose and then on the my forehead and the blush I use is NARS and it's orgasm I really love this blush the first time I went into Sephora to get it I thought it looked so pretty because it's more of like a pinkish brownish color because I'm not a really big fan of just pink I like a blend of both of them you're just gonna do the same thing with your face but this one's gonna go directly After on I your cheek. After I just get, I got this at Fair Minerals. Also, it came with the packet that I told you all about. It's more of like a powder brush, I guess. I just go in and try to blend in my blush and my bronzer. And if I put too much on, this also helps to take some of it After off. After you're done with that, then come my eyebrows.